So that song was in my head as I fell asleep last night, and it kept going over and wow. over. Not that that's a bad thing. Because well, hey. <laughs> I feel like I need to apologize for no, that. No, 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 not at all. <laughs> was that the first song you wrote for this new album? Did I read that correctly? It mm. was one of the first ones. Yeah. Okay. Some of them have been like around a lot longer just yeah. in our... Good Luck Kid's been around since yeah. the last tour. But okay. That yeah. was like the first one that we were like, we're going to put this on the album. New album. Yeah, and it's pretty significant. Tell yeah. the backstory behind that. Megan. Oh man. Well, we <laughs> fight. <laughs> <laughs> no, we didn't. I mean like we we didn't fight that much before. We're very like under the rug sort of style communicators, which is really helpful. Um and there was a lot going on and it just kind of came to a head and we had to fight it out. We fought it out. There was Seattle. a minor car accident. Minor car accident. Adelie running. I've never gotten a speeding <laughs> ticket or been in an accident and these that two moment made that happen so <laughs> yeah i knocked you somebody's i yeah. um some guy had a big truck with one of those like extendable mirrors on the side and i oh, was like yeah. you guys need to calm down <laughs> and then i'm like bam and hit his window his whole his mirror fall, yeah fell off his and then it's bed. raining natalie runs to the house and it was yeah. crazy you guys it was we, a drama but moment. listen but we're we, here and we've worked it through yeah we have committed <laughs> to working things out now I have three sisters, so oh. this conversation you guys are just having <laughs> happens You've all the time. Yeah, yeah, I've yeah, had yeah. It a number of okay. times. Hopefully not very many car tracks. accidents. No accidents. Yeah. <laughs> good. Very not good. for the best. No accidents. So what's fascinating to me is that you grew up in a musical household, and it wasn't until, I mean, you were in your 20s that you yeah. said, hey, I need you guys. I mean, you hadn't performed. You hadn't really sung together before then. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> I like to be the center of attention. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> no, I'm the oldest, and I just, you know, it was like I sang, and um, so she it was, was just kind sure, of the like thing. The you guys were so family. shy. You yeah, guys we were, were so shy, shy back mm, then, and shy. like we lived in Estacada, and you know, they were, there was Rascal Flats playing, and I was home from college. And they were just belting out the bridge of Here Comes Goodbye. And I was like, like and, and like harmonizing to the runs. And I was like, I'm sorry, you can do what? Like, <laughs> I did not realize. Uh, we owe our career doing? to Rascal Flats. We do. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. So when did it start feeling like you were a band instead mm -hmm. of just sort of, you know, that. It, hooking on to a big sister and exactly. you know trying to get out of her shadow. I actually remember, and I don't Plus. know if any of you guys have been around for the, like this. What I'm about to say, but the um, we went, we had a beach trip where we wrote this song together. It was the first song that we really like wrote together, where we weren't Megan and I weren't just harmonizing on Natalie's songs, and it was called High Society. Anybody in here what? remember that? Say yes? Wow! Oh. <laughs> Deepest cut. That wow. was the first song we that wrote together. That was the together. first song we Very wrote together, and that was like, I mean, it's crazy. But it, um, that was the first moment that I was like, oh, we're doing this together. It's not just like, we're not just the backup singers. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Cool. It was pretty cool. Nice. Wow. So Good Luck Bonus Kid points. just came out Friday. Everyone's yeah. got a copy, right? Yeah. That's well. what I thought. <laughs> uh, and there's another song on there called Good Luck Kid. And when I uh, saw the backstory of it, I went, oh, yeah, I remember that feeling. Mm -hmm. Turning 30 and 30 is like, I'm an adult now. Yeah. Now what? Yeah. What do I? Because there's no road map. Uh -huh. So tell me a little bit more about that. Yeah. Thanks, me. <laughs> <laughs> She's you like, can squeeze my, my shoulder 20s. in a couple of years. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yeah. Oh gosh, I don't know. I think that it's like, it's that feeling where uh, the more you learn, the less you know sort of thing. It's just like, okay, in my 20s, I was like, I know everything. Mm, me too. The I world too. is figured out for me. <laughs> and it just isn't anymore. And, um, you know, it's it can be unnerving and unsettling, but it's also really freeing because it's like I'm open, I'm I'm curious, and I, I don't pretend to have the answers, you know. So the song came from me talking to my husband Chris about it, and I was like, it just feels like the internet. Ugh, the internet. Like, <laughs> what? I am I'm like I'm looking to all my Gen Z folks and just being like, teach me your ways. Um, but. I was telling Chris about it and he was like, yeah, it's like the universe stopped the car. 
you know, got out, tossed you the keys and said, good luck, kid. And I was like, oh, That's my gosh, the title. that is it. That is the feeling. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. So uh, you're going to be at Music Millennium at two. Yes. Mm-hmm. And then Roseland Theater tonight for the yes. second show. Yes. Tickets yes. still available, by yes. the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Tickets. if you're looking for something to do on a Sunday night. Sunday night. We know here. where and you should be. our parents are working the crowd. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> they Very are. Good. You need a drink? What's happening? <laughs> you need a drink. <laughs> so a couple more songs from you guys? Yeah, we'd love yes. that. Awesome. Let's hear it for Joseph. All right. Thank you. 